look beautiful. Thank you. Everyone wants to know, how are you doing? I mean, after the separation with PK. One how day at a time, you know? One day at a time. You know, are you guys still working on things and figuring it out, maybe? We're trying to focus on the kids. Okay. Yeah. Is, is, is the hope maybe to get back together or like... Oh, I don't know. That's, that's not a question just for me, you know? I know. One step at a time. Will we, will we see it play out on the show? Oh, yeah. Yeah, everything's on the show. It's a reality show. It's our reality. <laughs> so you're going to show it all. You're not going to like hide anything from no, us. No, I'm not hiding anything. Okay, no, well, I no can't design. wait to see it. Thank all right, you. well, thank you so much. Thank you. I got your wig, I got your wig, ho. Ha, ha. You're mad. Miss Wikiana. Miss Wig, Miss Wig. Miss Wikiana. It's sad and it's hard. It's also no secret. We've had a really rough couple of years. Yes. We've had a rough couple of years. I feel very hurt by you, Erica. Obviously, I'm sure you know why. What Bravo Liberty relationship do you think is headed to Splitsville next? I think it's Dorit and PK. To see you behave like that was deeply hurtful. Um, I didn't want to answer that question, and I asked not to. Uh, I don't want to answer this question because I, I feel bad. You delivered that answer like someone who really wanted that attention. Three, I'm a showman. I walked right down to the edge of that stage and I gave those people what they wanted. I kind of thought that you were going to lead with an apology rather than defending it. Well, it's not a defense. It's just an explanation of how it went down. It was a shady question. And, and an I gave a shady answer. answer. Dorit, is your marriage strong? You know how much I love my husband. We had a really difficult year. He was spending a lot of time in London. He had a lot of business there. And it was a year that I needed him the most. You didn't feel protected. Well, I also didn't feel supported right. enough. And I yeah. didn't feel as connected. Sausage, it's just chicken sausage that you asked for. I didn't ask for chicken sausage. I'm all right, you? You made it home. I spoke to you last night. Dorit's dress is beautiful. Erica's dress is short. <laughs> Who wins? My wife. If we, if we had to take the wives out of the... Who wins? Who wins? Your wife. No, both wives are out. Oh, so I have to pick anybody but your anybody, wife my wife? Yeah. Always been the girl that soldiers on. That's who I am. That's who PK knows. Right. I definitely underestimated how big of a setback this last incident had on Was. me. We've been robbed three times, right? The first time, he's been caught. He's been sent to jail for 25 years. Done. Second time, they haven't done it, the home invaders. But when Dorit had her, I don't even know if you know this, when Dorit had her money stolen, at Marshall's when they took the handbag, they caught him as well. And now they, they caught him. And now the probation, yeah, the probation officer rang me. Well, whoever they caught and said, do you want restitution and all how this? Come, how come no one said anything well, to me? Well, you know what? I don't particularly want to talk about traumatic things. Do you know what I mean? I mean, it's Sweetheart, like... Sweetheart, I would love to know yeah, that they, caught they did. Him. They caught that, that gang. There was three guys. I know two I, of them I, I had I don't priors, know, but all I know is they called But him. they have one? Yeah. They have one? Yeah. So who, who did you speak to, the detective? I spoke to the detective and then I spoke, the probation officer called me. Because there's a thing in America called restitution, which basically means... You have to pay he's, back. He has to pay it back, but he can't pay it back, so he pays back at £25 PK, a month forever. honey, why am I not involved? He's paying it back in pounds? I think... No, he's not paying back in pounds. <laughs> anyway, it, it, it doesn't... No, sweetheart, Honey, what, I only just, took the call yesterday from the probation officer. I just love that I'm learning about this now. PK was pouring alcohol on his. It got 
very, very, very toxic. There was so much subtext happening at the last reunion. When you said that you were better than ever with yeah. PK, I got the sense that some other people in the room weren't buying it. And I mm -hmm. wonder now, were you better than ever or were you putting on a brave front? No, we were better than ever. You were. Absolutely. Wow. It's weird and how that happens, where you, you're at a high and then all of a sudden it's a crash and it's very, it's, it really is triggering. Wow. Well, people think that, you know, oh, I must have not been telling the truth. Andy, he had just gotten sober. He was four months sober. Okay. And when, when that happened, things were fantastic. Yeah. I mean, they really were. Right. That doesn't mean that all of our issues that were buried, that are buried there, don't won't resurface yeah. because that's exactly what happened. It's not one thing, you know, there was nothing, no catastrophic event, no one cheated on anyone. A week ago, there was a moment and it was over nothing and one thing led to another and we sat down like two very mature adults who love and care about one another and mutually decided that taking some space and separating is the best thing for us. Is it like a temporary sip, or are we just taking it day by day? We're taking it, we're taking it day by day, but we are separating. Okay. So there's no time on it, but there's work to do. It feels like super real, and I didn't expect to react like that. It's like I was what? fine this morning, yeah, and then. Hey, PK, how are you doing? Good, thank you. I'm so sorry to hear about sorry, you and Dorit. Can I ask how long you guys have been separated or, or if you are staying at the Beverly Hills Hotel? Thank you, PK. So you've been through a big day today. Uh, I've been separated now nearly a year, you know, and, and I've recently, you know, moved out. During this process, you're gonna have hard days, you're gonna have easier days, there's gonna be days that you wake up and you're gonna just be miserable. Um, I've kind of learned how to enjoy the journey versus looking for a solution, right? Yeah. Carl text me. She did. Yeah. Beautiful. I sent it to PK and I was I was like, I want to send this, but I'm so scared. A, she's going to show it. B, she's going to think I'm being manipulative by sending her a nice supportive text because I'm supposed to see her at Sutton's house. So I called Eric. I'm like, I'm really in a pickle. I don't know what to do. And, and said, then she told it. me that none of the cast had reached out. Yeah, no one had reached out. Nobody had reached out to her and it really broke my heart. So And I, I thought, said, you have, and she said to me, and Kyle said, I've written this text. I sent it to PK. I haven't sent it to Dorit, and I said, you must send it. Yeah, yeah, because once I knew that, I was like, I don't care what she thinks no, about it, this text for me, to. I'm sending it. We were like in Bonnie and Clive. She was my shadow, we were together. I'd go out, she'd come and stylize the evening, and she'd socialize, and, and, yeah. and life got in the way. You yeah. know, and we had the babies, and then we moved. She could say, well, you were away, and I could say, well, I was working, trying to sustain the lifestyle that Dorit and I live. What is the current status with you and PK? Um, things are good. We are friendly and we're communicating and things are status quo. No, you are not divorced. No, we're not. You are separated. Yes. And divorce is not in process. No, and nor is it even a topic of conversation. <laughs>
Ew. Uh, like JK, but like maybe not. But thank you for watching. But you hating ass bitches always have something to say. Hating ass bitch, but you're still watching my vids. What? 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 <laughs> you're so upset. But that's like okay because have a piece of bread, have a Xanax, relax because I said what I said.